Hi, I'm Dave, your Inside Support Specialist at Bysher Lock and Security. Today, I'm going to go over how to create a view in the Milestone XProtect Smart Client. A view is a predetermined arrangement and layout of cameras that are available to you on your camera system. To create one, you need to enter the setup mode. If you don't have setup, toggle from simplified to advanced, and then the setup will be available to you. Once in setup, on the top left of the screen, you'll see the different view groups. The view groups are typically shared with other users on your system, except for the private view group. Those are views that are available only to you. So let's open the private group and we're going to create a new group within there. And we will call this demo views. And then with demo view selected, I'm going to click create new view. And then milestone is going to ask me, how do I want the new view laid out? As I mouse over, it'll give me my different options with camera counts and arrangements of the display. I'm going to select the one by five option under four by three. Now I have a bunch of empty squares that I need to do something with. On the left side of the screen, I'm going to find my server name and expand that to the cameras folder. Then I'll just click and drag the cameras that I want to include in this view to that location. You can fill the entire view up with just different cameras, or you have other options. You can use a hotspot, which brings full screen any of the cameras that you click on in live view, or you can add a carousel, which will cycle through cameras. When you drag the carousel option to a square in your view, this menu comes up. Expand the available cameras. And then add each one that you want to include in the carousel. And you can adjust the time that it will dwell as it rotates through the cameras. Select OK. Now both the hotspot and the carousel will only work in live view. You won't see anything in the setup view. Let's go ahead and add one more camera over to the view. Now before I go, we need to rename this view so that I know what it is I'm looking at once I get a few more options in there. Just have to hit the pencil and give it a name. Once I'm satisfied, I just click setup to go back into normal operation. And now my view is live and working. You'll see my carousel is cycling through the cameras that I selected. Now this is my hotspot. That changes as I click the different cameras that are available to me. That's all there is to it. That's how you create and manage views in the XProtect Smart Client. If you have any questions or requests for future videos, please email me at support at stlsecurity.com. Thanks for watching.